So let's do another quick quiz to find out. When making a cake, do you prefer to... So hands up for each one again. Do you prefer to use a recipe book with pictures? Yeah, a few people. Have a friend talk you through? Or have a go making it up as you go along? Quite a few people there. OK, so if you said A, then this means that you're a visual learner and that you learn best when information is presented in a visual style. If you said B, it means you're an auditory learner, that you learn best when information is presented to you in an auditory format. And if you said C, it means that you're a kinesthetic learner, that you learn best when you get stuck in and do things with your hands. Except, of course, as you probably guessed, that it doesn't, because the whole thing is a complete myth. Learning styles are made up and are not supported by scientific evidence. So we know this because in tightly controlled experimental studies, when learners are given material to learn, either in their preferred style or an opposite style, it makes no difference at all to the amount of information that they retain. And if you think about it for just a second, it's just obvious that this has to be true. It's obvious that the best presentation format depends not on you, but on what you're trying to learn. Could you learn to drive a car, for example, just by listening to someone telling you what to do with no kinesthetic experience? Could you solve simultaneous equations by talking them through in your head and without writing them down? Could you revise for your architecture exams using interpretive dance if you're a kinesthetic learner? No, what you need to do is match the material to be learned to the presentation format, not you.